Here I just want to give you a really quick breakdown of the Panther kit. It's proven to be our most popular kit. It's more, it comes in the Everly stock half track bag. These bags are awesome, 1000 denier nylon. It's got the integrated rain fly on the bottom, molly straps on all sides. Got the wool blanket, 90% wool, it's really heavy duty in the waterproof stuff sack. You can submerge this sack for a little while and still have it remain waterproof. Great thing about the molly straps on all sides of the bag is you can customize wherever you want to keep the blanket or any other hardware you choose to put on your bag. Going forward, in the body of the bag, we have, this is what it looks like when we ship it to you. You're encouraged to organize it as you see fit. Inside, we got the bivy sack. It comes standard with the ultralight bivy. These things are great for keeping off the moisture, keeping off the bugs. Thermal sleeping bag liner adds a lot of warmth to your night. Trust me, I've tested it. Here we have the wool socks. Awesome little socks. Thick merino wool. Really helps to hold the blisters down. We've got the stationary kit. It's got all your stationary needs in any situation. Comes in a waterproof case. We've got the Nalgene bottle. Not just good for transporting water, but anything that you might need to transport in a sealed container. Holds it in there nice. The PPE kit with your rubber palm gloves, your foam earplugs, your Neosh 90 particle filter, and impact resistant eyewear. Also great for keeping bugs out of your eyes as you travel through swamps and lowlands. We got the water filter, comes standard with the Catadine Vario, does about 500 gallons, uh, all plastic construction. This does really well. I've actually, I've actually filtered some really putrid swamp water out of this stuff and filled up my camo bladder and was no worse for wear. Uh, we got the 100 feet of paracord, 550. For a fully comprehensive first aid kit. Has everything you need for anything you'll need outside of a combat situation. We got the mess kit. Mess kit is 18-8 stainless. Comes in a stuff sack. You got the plate slash pot lid. You got the knife, spoon, and fork. We got the pot holder and the two-quart pot. I have put these pots on fires and got them red hot. They don't warp, they don't burn. You just cool them off and throw them right back in your bag. We got these survival rations, made a Coast Guard certified. These are great. They taste like apple cinnamon crumb cake. They've got three blocks for three meals a day. I've actually stretched these out over five days instead of the standard three you get out of it. And the great thing about this, when, as opposed to protein bars or MREs, which tend to taste like slow death and then on day three taste even worse, these on day three still taste like apple cinnamon crumb cake. We got the 18-inch Ontario knife sawback machete. Great little tools. I beat the hell out of these. I've hit rocks. They don't chip. They don't break, even in cold weather. Heavy-duty sheath. Got the ripstop nylon rain poncho. Again, heavy-duty. I've run through thorn bushes in these, and they don't puncture. They don't rip. They got two-way snaps. Turn into a small shelter. You can fold them out into a tarp. Great rain ponchos. Two 48-gallon contractor bags, heavy-duty, million uses. Here we got the hygiene kit, a couple rolls of toilet paper, toothbrush, toothpaste, survival mirror, soap sheets, disposable razor, and tampons. Everything you might need in survival hygiene. On this side of the pack comes with the three-liter hydration bladder. Fill it right up, right out of the water filter, and head on your way. Again, these things are great in any environment, be it city or rural. And here we got the headlamp, Black Diamond Revolt. Comes with the bright white, comes with the dim light, comes with the red light night vision. Has a lockout feature and a battery life display. Also, great little th thing about this is it comes with three rechargeable batteries inside and a charging port on the side, so you can plug it in just like any cell phone into a wall outlet, a car charger, or a solar charger and recharge your batteries, which is a great little feature. We've got three bandanas, black, green, and orange. We've got fire kit. It's got the Bic lighters, the waterproof matches, the magnesium bar with ferro rod, and the burn wet fire starter sticks. And this little bag of toys comes map compass, fish hooks, fishing line, 
Stuff's not just great for fishing, but I've also used it for setting perimeter alerts around a, my, in my case, a campsite. You can also use a building, uh, make traps with it, catch some small critters for dinner. Got the survival whistle, which got the thermometer on the back. It's got another compass, got a magnifying glass, and these are great for saving your voice if you get stuck or need to signal for help. It's ear piercingly loud. It'll you can blow this as long as there's air in your breath and not scream your voice out. You got the cord charger for the headlamp and three extra batteries. We've got the super glue, which is great for mending bags, mending clothes. I've actually used it when the sole of my shoe let go. I glued the sole back on and it's still with me to this day. And we have the two 50 inch rolls of duct tape. Leatherman multi-tool. This is the Leatherman Rev, comes standard in the kit. Tube of 30 SPF sunscreen. Bottle of 100% DEET bug spray. And last but not least is the zip ties. Million uses in a survival situation. This is a quick breakdown of the kit. If you want a much more comprehensive and in-depth breakdown, there's another video on our YouTube channel. Feel free to subscribe to our YouTube channel. We put up new videos from time to time. And feel free to like us on Facebook as we're there too. Thanks for watching.